From all nighter study sessions to having a newborn baby, sometimes life stops you from getting enough sleep. In Western culture, sleep deprivation is a major problem. Recent statistics show that an estimated 70 million Americans have a sleep disorder. Like breathing, sleeping is a fundamental human requirement. But have you ever wondered what happens to you when you don't sleep at all? Welcome back to Life's Biggest Questions, the channel that asks the fundamental questions of life. I'm Charlotte Dobre, and today we're going to answer the question what happens when you don't sleep? So Firstly, we are going to look at the short term effects of not sleeping enough, starting at 24 hours without sleep. According to the International Journal of Occupational Medicine and Environmental Health, the consequences of sleep deprivation is comparable to the cognitive impairment of someone with a blood alcohol content of 0.1%. So in other words, if you don't sleep, your judgement is impaired the same way it would be as if you had several alcoholic drinks, depending on your gender and body weight. The study went on to say that at 24 hours, judgement is affected, memory is impaired, there is deterioration in decision making and a decline in hand eye coordination. At 24 hours without sleep, you'll also become more emotional and your attention span will decrease. Your hearing will also be impaired. Next, at 36 hours without sleep, your health is actually at risk. Inflammatory markers are released into the bloodstream at high levels. This can lead to high blood pressure and cardiovascular disease. Your hormones are also affected at this point and your emotions will be all over the map. Next, at 48 hours without sleep, your body will actually begin to shut down for something called a micro sleep. Micro sleeps are similar to blackouts, where your body goes to sleep on its own without warning. These episodes can last anywhere between half a second to half a minute, and they are followed by a period of disorientation. Your body will shut down to sleep regardless of what you're doing, and you won't be aware that it's happening, which is incredibly dangerous, especially if you're driving. At 72 hours without sleep, that's when you'll start to hallucinate. A hallucination is the perception of something that is not really present in the environment, which is a misinterpretation of something that is present. Around 80% of people who are sleep deprived will hallucinate. Most of these hallucinations will be visual. In short, sleep deprivation can cause symptoms that are similar to mental illness, like paranoid thoughts. Things like concentration, motivation, perception, and other higher mental processes will be hindered after many sleepless hours. Prolonged sleep deprivation, or even going one night without sleep, can impede your body's natural defenses against microorganisms. Not sleeping actually heightens your risk of infection. One study found that 2% of people who are sleep deprived for 112 hours, experienced temporary conditions that were similar to acute paranoid schizophrenia. Of course, these symptoms went away once the subject was permitted to sleep. Extended periods of time without sleep can cause an array of physical effects and symptoms that can eventually lead to death. It increases the risk of cardiovascular diseases, like a stroke, and even cancer. Not to mention, the more tired you are, the higher at risk you are of being involved in a fatal accident. Drowsy driving caused 7,200 crashes and 800 deaths in the US from 2009 to 2013, according to the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration. Moral of the story, we all need sleep. It is vital to your health. If you're not getting enough sleep, you're clinically sleep deprived. Be good to yourself and to your body and allow yourself that few extra hours a night to let your body rejuvenate. If you are experiencing sleep deprivation due to insomnia, consider speaking with your doctor. I'm Charlotte Dobre for Life's Biggest Questions. Don't forget to like this video, share it with a friend and subscribe to our growing channel.